After almost 20 years of union organizing in California, Cesar Chavez has won his biggest victory. Legislation that will allow California farm workers to choose by secret ballot the union of their choice, the Teamsters or the United Farm Workers. After a special mass at Our Lady of Mount Carmel Church, Chavez and friends began their walk from the San Isidro border checkpoint to Salinas, California, and finally to where it all began, Delano. It's a very long march, and uh, it's going to be difficult, but we're determined that, that it's best that if we're going to get the message to every single worker that we have to walk. We can't fly and we can't drive because uh, driving and flying is just uh, too rapid, and we have to... Uh, try and uh, visit them where they work, uh, eat with them, uh, try to be with them, and, and uh, in any way that we can bring about the, the uh, dissemination of the news of the uh, new law and to, and to, as I said before, try and get them to, to begin to organize themselves. Has the boycott hurt the grower? Yes, sure, it it's puts them in a bind because they can't sell the grapes at, the, at, a, at a profit, and uh, the, we've cut down the the, uh, the amount of grapes being sold has been cut down considerably. And last year, as an example, in Delano, the grape growers found themselves with about 3 million boxes of surplus grapes they couldn't, they couldn't do anything with. Chavez claims the chains of oppression for the farm worker will soon be broken in California. With the TV8 Electro News Unit in San Diego, Roberto Salinas.